Alright, so we're about to do this a um, little bit of micro fishing down at my grandparents' uh, neighborhood. There's like a creek around the city. Anyway, so we're going to do a little urban, kind of urban micro fishing kind of deal. Uh, what I'm using is like a four foot really small rod and really lightweight using like four pound test. Using like really small jigs. I'll show them to you later. Uh, been doing it, been out here just for a couple minutes, going to call a few or whatever, but we're going to, we're going to catch some, so I'll just show y'all, so let's go. Alright, what's up guys, so, I want to show y'all the rig I have, hold on, go get it. Alright, so this is what I'm using, uh, it's very basic, very small, just very like, like brim and just pretty much panfish, bluegill. Uh, crappy brown, some stuff like that. It's uh, what is this? HU Express Tiny Rod. Um, I don't know what just happened. All right, so pretty much just using this little jig head with a little like crappy bait on the end of it. It's pretty like a tube bait, little deal. I can't remember how light it is, but it's pretty light. Four pound test. Um, so yeah, let's get to it. Let's go. All right, guys. So uh, I'm just gonna sit here and start fishing. Y'all just watch me from behind. We'll catch them. Let's get it. So pretty much just jigging it, just up and down, reeling it a little bit, just doing a few twitches. Sorry, you may not be able to hear me. There's like a waterfall over there. I'll try my best. There we go. Boom. Got one. See, we're just out here catching we're out here just catching little small ones, but it's it's fun to uh, just to get like the perspective of respecting those really small fish, you know, these really small panfish. You know, it's not all about just catching all like the. It's not all about quality, you know. Sometimes you can catch qual quantity, but like look how pretty a fish this is. This is a beautiful, a beautiful fish. I'll uh, keep you updated of what kind of fish this is, but I'm gonna put it in my bucket with a little bubble box, uh, not sponsored, but a little bubble box. Keep it uh, aerated, keep it alive. So he's just, uh, he's just gonna be swimming around that little, that little bucket. I already have like three fish in there. I kinda just keep it in there, just to like give him some oxygen before I put him back. Um, kinda just keep a number of how many fish I catch, so. Oh, that's a big frog, man. That frog or toad scared the living bejesus out of me. Oh my gosh, I want to show you all this. This is huge. Look at that frog. Oh, there he goes. Oh, into the water he goes. That was cool. That was really cool. Wow. Nature. Gotta love it. Alright, sorry guys. I'm like... I actually have y'all set up on a uh, like a tackle box, and I'm using my chest chest strap just so I can keep it level. So it may be a little a little rinky dink, but uh, you know it's gotta work. I'm using my phone for my monitor just so I can see what I'm looking at. All right, guys. So uh, that was that fish. Hey, as John B always says, you just gotta keep fishing, never stop. Even when you're just catching some small ones, just some, doing a little bit of micro fishing. Yeah, I totally forgot. I totally forgot to um, film the other two catches. That was my mistake. My mistake. But you know, we'll just keep. Kept, uh, we'll just. Uh, blah, blah. We'll just catch some more. So, so yeah, let's get back to it. So like I said earlier, I'm pretty much just reeling it in slow, just waiting for something to hit, and then. Don't set it too hard, like, don't set it like a bass, but, like, 
Cut it just enough where you can release all the slack out of your line. That's the number one key when you're fishing with uh, brim and panfish and crappie is to, and pretty much all fish, is just to keep, um, don't have any slack in your line. Keep it tight. Especially with panfish, you want to keep, you want to really keep the line tight because they really, they fight, they move around really fast and, and they can spit it out. Yeah. All right, so I'm actually going to show y'all what I've caught so far. All right, so here, I want to get this up. I'll show y'all what I've caught. Sorry, the wire's a little... Okay, I'll turn this off just for a little bit so y'all can see. But uh, we actually got... Oh, oh, they're moving. Well, we actually got three bearmen there. I'm actually going to turn that back on just to keep them alive. But yeah, I would put... I would put this down there but the water's really nasty and I don't know if y'all could see anything so you know what with enough of that we'll just um, keep fishing we'll just fish some more so like I said I'm just using using this little jig head neon jig head with a red eye with a little tube bait uh, actually oh it's right here it's a 116 ounce uh, painted round jig heads copy magic right there so yeah, if you ever want to use them, I pick them up at Walmart, they're really cheap. And then also, the two bait I'm using is a little mini tail. Um, cream mini tail. And it's um, a 10 pack of um, black archers. So I don't know if y'all can, oh, wrong way. That's what I'm using right there. So yeah, pretty much, pretty, really simple uh, setup. With, and um, the, the fish really do enjoy it. They really, they really eat it all the time. Like I come out here a lot, like when I'm bored, and just like it's an easy place to go fishing because it's literally like five seconds down from my grandparents' house, and I live literally like five minutes away. So it's it's a it's a cool place to just go and hang out, and it's also it's also like gated, so like no one can come in unless you if you like live here or if you know someone that lives here. And it's really cool because there's like a train that goes right there, so it's it's really cool to get back here and just relax. And you have the nice waterfall behind you. Yeah, so our summer just kicked off. Here, I want to actually talk to y'all like this. Hopefully this doesn't fall, but it's pretty good. But uh, anyway, so there we have. We just got out. Of, we just got out of school. Our summer just started, and so what I'm trying to do this summer, I'm not actually going anywhere. Normally, I'd be going to Greece or whatever, going on a big trip out of the state, but I'm actually trying to stay in and um, actually staying in state and um, staying in town and just working for my dad a little bit. And um, and what I'll be trying to do is fishing a lot more than I have. And that's like my number one goal this summer is to make a lot of more videos and film a lot more stuff and um, just go different places and fish on my kayak. Cause I got a kayak last year, and so I'm really trying to make like videos and stuff. So just uh, leave a comment if you want to, like. You can subscribe if you want. Uh, that would be deeply appreciated. I'm not trying to beg for likes. I just wanna, I just wanna know what y'all wanna see. And I just wanna make videos just, just to show how fishing is awesome. And I just wanna get people involved in fishing and really fun hopefully i'll be fishing with a lot more friends i have a fishing kind of tournament kind of thing with my friends that i've planned up and we're trying to do it this summer and i will um hopefully document everything make a video make more gopro videos and post them on youtube so i'm just trying to share the dream you know support the dream just share everything how fishing is really cool get others involved uh also um also so the whole Guggen squad pretty much got me into fishing. Whole John B. Perrick, um, Flair, uh, Lunkers TV, and Lake Fort guy pretty much all got me into star fishing. It really got me like wanting to make videos and stuff. So shout out to them. Go follow them. They're awesome. You probably would already follow them if you're following me. But anyways, so yeah, I'm just want to get back to fish. I just want to share a little bit. But just please leave a comment. 
uh, and leave something down low uh, of what you want to see next, like fish, next fishing videos and stuff, like more tutorials or stuff. But I'm really trying to use this, uh, really trying to use this, um, this channel more this summer. I've made it a few years ago, and I've only posted like two videos on it. But like, I'm really trying to post a lot more, a lot more like tutorials, like kayak fishing, bank fishing micro fishing bass fishing stuff like that so yeah i'm just gonna get fishing back get back fishing and keep y'all updated oh man just had him hmm. Another guy I look I look up to is uh, his name's Kendall Gray. He's a great YouTuber. He's like, like we're right around the same age, and you know he's just trying to share what he likes to do, just like I want to. And I may show some hunting videos when the season comes, just like him. I'm not really trying to copy him, but just trying to kind of do the same thing he does, but like try my own twist and stuff on it. And you know, just trying to fish, and it's fun. People look at it as oh, it's really boring. But, you know what? Sometimes it's great just to get outside on a beautiful day. Like I know it's not that beautiful, but you can turn this into like a day out on the water. Just just to get out of outside, you know, and enjoy nature. Just so it's a beauty. Alright, I'm actually gonna release this fish. I feel like I've had them in there for a while. I thought I'd catch more so I could like have fish like a big picture but uh I wanna do that real quick so uh, it was pretty much just really small fish but it's kinda hot out here. I got somewhere to be yeah, I think I'm just going to call it today, but yeah. It's pretty much just like a starter video, kind of like just one. Like, I wasn't really the main video, because it's kind of started late, but... Anyways, so I'm just going to pack up everything, pretty much. I'll get right back to y'all. So yeah, I guess we're just gonna head out and I'll get back to y'all do another video. But yeah, it's just pretty much making this one just as like an intro video kind of to the channel, you know. Also, I have an Instagram, it'll be down in the description. Oh no, that's not good. That's all in my car now. Rookie mistake. But yeah, pretty much. I was just what I was. What I was saying is, yeah, my fishing Instagram is down below in the description. Um, I'll just get out of here. It's really hot. So yeah, I guess I'll see y'all another day. See. Ya. just making this video just because I didn't make an outro to the old to the um, video I just had and I literally just made the same video the same outro but somehow it got deleted it, like the file like was corrupted so it didn't work so I have to film it again so in other words uh, I so I didn't catch that many fish and the 
this video but like this really wasn't a fishing video this is more like an introduction video for like my channel I'm really like trying to trying to use this channel more than I have I've only posted a few videos on there so I'm trying to post like way more videos get more involved with it just literally a kid with a GoPro and fit and is love to fish and pretty much just share it with everybody and you know um, just let everybody kind of know um, what else are I gonna say um, so yeah so I'm really planning on doing like a lot more fishing videos like bank fishing I got a kayak I use it all the time kayak fishing um, I really want to do some catching cooks catching cooks are really fun I have a big tournament um, actually actually have like this big tournament kind of thing like all these details that are very important um, details for a fishing tournament so like two of my other friends two of my early friends and pretty much just like a three stage tournament where um, we each go out and fish different local places we always go fish at and, or whatever but whenever that video comes I'll give you the more details and stuff and anyways but whatever y'all want to see I'll try to recreate or try to make videos on that I just want to know like what everybody wants to see because I want to be making like the same stuff just be really lame or whatever cool my light just went out but that's sick I want to actually see if this is back on okay cool it's back all right that was weird anyways so yeah I was just I just want to like see what y'all want to see and make it um so yeah just subscribe drop a like just just try to get try to, okay there goes my light again nice okay anyways just try to get this video out just trying to get more views and stuff oh it's back cool sick nice anyways so yeah just leave um leave a comment down below um also follow my instagram page i'm just going to end I'm just going to ignore my light because it keeps going on and off for some reason. Anyways, just follow my Instagram. It's down in the description or whatever. I post pretty much daily pictures of me fishing and just stuff like that. Also, just uh, like, subscribe, or whatever. And so, yeah. So, I guess I'll see you all in the next video. See you.